Hello, we are back at Pufferbelly's Toys and Books in downtown Stanton, Virginia. We are here with Erin S. Hi, Erin S. Hello. And also, a science kit. It's called Rainbow Crystals. It's from Scientific Explorer. The science kit is for ages five and up, and it looks like so much fun we just had to try it out. Um, there are some experiments in the book, and they start with things like growing regular old like plain crystals, but we didn't want to do that. We wanted to skip that and dive right into the colorful part. So we're going to do what? We are going to grow hundreds of color changing soft crystals. Okay. Not colored, yes, color changing soft crystals. Excellent. So here we go. So I have filled up test tube with water. It comes with two test tubes. And the next step is I have to open the test tube without spilling it all over the place. Mm, good luck. Yes. And the directions tell me to pour the water into one of the Ziploc bags. Excellent. So there's our water. Perfect. Next, the fun <laughs> part. I get to drop in a blue tablet. And as you can oh, see, it's, it's fizzing. fizzing away. Okay, so our tablet has all but dissolved in here. So we're going to carefully open the bag. And now the instructions tell me to pour in one scoop of these little teeny tiny, Ooh. what are going to become the rainbow crystals. They're itty bitty. But they are polymers. What's a polymer, you might ask? Uh, uh. The directions tell me, because I'm not a scientist. <laughs> <laughs> it's simply a long chain of repeating molecules. And these are super absorbent polymers. Okay. So there's one. there's one. And then we're going to pour the rest of our little scoop in there. Mm. Get in there, you. And then what do we do? And then we're going to seal it up. And here comes the hard part. We have to leave it for at least an hour. An hour later or several hours later. Yes. <laughs> and we are back with our color changing rainbow crystals. So what happened? I'm dying to know. Okay. Where are they? Where well, are they? <gasps> here are the blue ones oh, that we did. Oh, look at that. They just sucked up all that water and those tiny, tiny little whitish crystals that we put in the bag are now giant blue blobby sparkly gems. I, I call them sapphires. They're so pretty. So I'm going to just quickly blot these off. They're so fancy. They are also squishy. Oh, they're they bouncy. Will bounce. Yes. Oh, there goes one. Get back in line, you. All right. And while we were gone, we went ahead and made the red crystals, mm -hmm. the rubies. Yes. <laughs> and the yellow crystals, the citron. Mm. And put them in the test tube. Now you may say, where are the blue ones going to go? We are going to squish them down in here. Do it. So we're squishing them together, and then what do we think is going to happen? Well, if it all goes as planned, we will be able to see red crystals, orange crystals, yellow crystals, green crystals, mm, and blue crystals. Because they're kind of going to share their they're gonna mojo back and yes. forth. Mm, that's the scientific term. I already have. It's turning green in there. We've got some green crystals going on oh, there. So the mushing down part kind of like hastens the the sharing of the colors. Okay, right. so we're gonna pack in the crystals and then we're gonna come back and take a look in just a minute. This is our crystal rainbow. And so yesterday you saw, or, hmm. <laughs> Oh, busted. It's an hour later, Erin Right, previously you saw <laughs> that we put, we put the red crystals in, yes. and then put the yellow ones on top, yes. and then the blue ones on top, smooshed them down, and tightened the test tube. Now you see we have red, orange, yellow, green, kind of a little teal, and blue. But what about purple? Well, to get purple, you would have needed to flip the yellow and the blue. We could also have put some more red crystals on the top. Yes. Yeah, and that would have worked too. But anyway, yes. yeah, so it came out great. It's a beautiful rainbow. All we need are like some unicorns dancing around and then puffer bellies would be magical absolutely place. complete <laughs> so we did that using this kit the rainbow crystals kit from scientific explorer that's recommended for ages five and up it is in stock right here at puffer bellies and this is just one of several experiments that you can do with this. yes you can do loads and loads of really cool stuff and we have lots of other great science stuff too so don't miss it and we'll see you soon bye, bye.